and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to talk about empties, empty perfume bottles and beauty products. So let's start the video and if you like this type of content about perfumes and beauty then please subscribe to my channel. And uh, yeah, let's start. So first one, uh, it's a very lovely, uh, super affordable fragrance, which I've managed to finish. Uh, one last drop left. And this one is Avon. Um, and this is Avon um, Elegance, Eve Elegance. And uh, would I repurchase this perfume? Um, I'm not sure. It's really good. It is actually... Um, a fresher dupe for Gucci bamboo as you can see the bottle resembles the Gucci um, so yeah it's a, it is a great perfume really great for the price it's super affordable so I'm not sure if I would purchase uh, right now because I have lots of affordable ones at the moment so I'm good but in the future possibly so yeah, this is really a, a great little affordable for perfume. Then um, we have Alien. Alien is completely empty, not even a drop left in the bottle. So definitely will be repurchasing in the winter. So this is if you, in case you don't know, which is probably impossible not to know about this fragrance, but it's a very sexy jasmine fragrance. Um, it's super long lasting and super amazing and um, perfect for a night out so i think i might be repurchasing this one for the winter but uh, in the summer i'm thinking about another alien maybe uh, alien or sublime or one of those other lighter fresher type of aliens so yeah but definitely otherwise would definitely repurchase this one next up we have Daisy um, from Marc Jacobs and this is the black edition so this one I've this is my second bottle of this uh, fragrance and I love it so much it's a white floral it's quite sexy actually as well and uh, it's great for going out it's a bit woody it has violet in it it has um, grapefruit it, it's quite fresh to start but then it's quite quite kind of uh, sexy and woody <laughs> So this one, um, I'm not sure if I would be repurchasing again right now because I finished it and I had it for, uh, for a bit, but um, I think I definitely would uh, want another daisy to try out another daisy. There's so many of them. So um, maybe like a summery daisy or something more versatile. Yeah, so, but yeah, I definitely love Daisy uh, in general by Mike Jacobs, so definitely love this one. So these are the three bottles of perfumes that I managed to empty recently. Hopefully there will be more that I'll be emptying, but as you know, I have loads, so it's very difficult to actually empty a bottle. But anyway, moving on to beauty products. And uh, I wanted to tell you about a few... Uh, beauty products that I uh, always empty and one of them is this one the uh, L'Oreal uh, Volume Million Lashes uh, this is a mascara that I empty all the time so uh, this one is uh, an amazing mascara I swear by it it doesn't um, doesn't uh, crumble away it stays in place it's really long um, uh, lengthening and uh, thickening uh, you know I don't really have big lashes myself so it really does the job uh, with lashes so and of course it's very affordable from from L'Oreal and uh, now there is a new version um, with a balm so I might try that one but yeah generally I will definitely stick to this one so we'll repurchase this one then next up, I wanted to tell you about the toothpaste and it's actually <laughs> it's one that I actually already repurchased and the reason why I wanted to tell you about it, I know it's not really beauty products, more like a maintenance product, but the reason why it is because this toothpaste is fluoride free. This is from this brand that you can read here. 
you can um, if you just type the name you can buy it obviously in the UK and um, this toothpaste doesn't have the fluoride and it's really really gentle it does the job obviously but it's so gentle it doesn't really irritate your gums and um, it's a great toothpaste and I switched to the fluoride free toothpaste uh, recently and I've seen a huge improvement um, so yeah definitely if you're looking for a fluoride free toothpaste then this is the one and it's um, it's fresh it's minty it's perfect but it doesn't have the fluoride which we don't want so next up is my favorite shampoo one of my favorites it's completely empty I definitely will be repurchasing this one this is very good for uh, if you have any type of problems with your scalp it's super gentle for your scalp and for your hair and it's a great you know everyday um, shampoo very delicate it does what it says on the tin it's delicate it's creamy it's um, just a super easy and it really helps it it helped me with my uh, scalp when it was um, getting irritated with other products so as soon as it gets irritated I straight away uh, switch to this one and uh, it really kind of I want to say cures it but obviously it's not a cure but you know what I mean it's so so gentle it just helps with any type of itchiness or irritation so definitely will be buying this one again then next up i have this cream uh, it is a mattifying day cream from nivea again very affordable and um yeah definitely will be repurchasing this one this is the um just a day cream very simple but it does the job it does mattify the skin uh, maybe not super long lasting mattifying effect but maybe three three hours um so yeah i do enjoy this cream it's it's not sticky it's just very comfortable to use so definitely will buy this one and of course it's very affordable as well and next up we have a sun lotion um, so this is the um i'm not sure how to pronounce it peace win or i don't know you can see the name so um this is a very nice um sun protecting lotion it has 30 spf and it is really good because it's not super sticky you know some of some of these sun lotions they they can be sticky they can smell strange this one doesn't smell weird and it's not extremely sticky it does have a bit of a stickiness to it but it's not horrible um so uh, and it definitely does the job it really protects from the sun so i finished the bottle and um i will be repurchasing the next uh, next time i need um sun protection which might be soon <laughs> because we have amazing sun nowadays in london last few days next up we have um an, an empty glow mask from l'oreal and this is the um one of their clay collection and i repurchased this one whenever i uh, run out so definitely will be repurchasing this is really great for um, just reviving your skin increasing the glow and exfoliating and again very affordable so definitely love this one and will be repurchasing next up we have um another um hair conditioner this is as you can see it's well used but i've managed to finally uh, finish this giant bottle this is the tresemme uh, moisture rich um, uh, for damaged hair conditioner and uh, it really does the job it uh, really uh, uh, untangles the hair it's great if you have um, damaged hair it really helps so yeah and again affordable so really um really great and uh, yeah definitely will be repurchasing this one as well and last but not least um this is uh, obviously a very 
very uh, unassuming Nivea um, body, uh, sorry, the <laughs> lip balm and uh, it's just like a Vaseline type of lip balm. It's really good. I love it and I know it's just not nothing special but you know it's just like a really great um, moisturizing um, lip balm that you can use every day so definitely love this one. I love the Nivea range. I know it's nothing special again but it's one of those everyday products that we all use I think um, unless maybe you're a billionaire and you only use a super expensive products then go for it. But uh, sometimes we do use these affordable ones as well and uh, yeah love this one. So that's it for today. I wanted to um, thank you so much for watching and uh, I hope to see you soon in the next video. Maybe um, some new perfumes or some new reviews, we'll see. And um, have a great day. Lots of hugs. Thank you for watching. Bye.